so I came across this question on the internet today while searching for my for for my bitch you feel me <laughs> you know while I while I'm out here surfing across the internet I just so I have to come upon this question if some guy sends your girl an unsolicited dick pic will you look See, upon initial initial observation of what the fuck I just said, you most likely thought, no, that's gay. And I understand, I understand, you know, looking at another nigga dick, you know, it's kind of sus. It's kind of sus. But at the same time, bro, you gotta look, man. You gotta, bro. You gotta see if this dude has more meat than you, bro. If he's packing more more meat on his kebab than you, bro, like, can you really trust your girl? No, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. But it's like, you gots to know, bro. Like, it's like if he has that much confidence to just, like, put his dick out in the DMs, he got to be confident in his package. You feel me? Like, he got he to gotta have the, like, he can't be like slacking in the, in the shit. You gotta know if he got a bigger dick or not, bro. It's just one of the things. I don't know why y'all so caught up with this toxic masculinity. Sometimes y'all just gotta pull out y'all feminine side and be like, let me see that dick, bro. You feel me? Like, it's just one of them things, bro. I gotta know if he packing more. I got to know. And then I also have to know what color he is, bro. I gotta know who I gotta find so I can kill this motherfucker. Like, it's simple as that, bro. I, if, if some dude sends my girl a dick pic, she, she most likely not gonna want that. I'm not gonna say she isn't gonna want that because some of these girls are hoes. But I'm saying most, if they are in a good relationship with you, they will not want that. So it is your legal obligation as her man's to go put that nigga in his place. So, I gotta know what skin tone this nigga is so I can start comparing dicks. You feel me? Like I got I I got to find this dude, bro. So what I'm so with me personally, with me personally, I'm not recommending this. I'm saying this is what I will do. I will memorize the dick on that phone and I will start comparing everybody of his skin tone to that dick so if he a dark skin i'm looking at every dark skin i am pulling down their pants and inspecting their package got to make sure that that's not the nigga that sent that dick pic in my girl's dms because if he and when i find that motherfucker he is getting put down put down my nigga I'm not talking no easy put down. I'm talking you getting launched off the roof into my combos, my nigga. I'm talking about some uppercut into uppercut into side beat into a fucking uh, tornado kick into ground pound, bro. You are getting that XYYBBA combo, my nigga. You are getting the work done. I was like, he finna get ultra combo. I'm finna get my x-ray by the end. We do, by the time we finish, like, fighting, bro. And then I'm gonna use that on your ass. Like, it's simple, bro. I gotta, I gotta beat this nigga ass. And I gotta do it by any means necessary. I don't recommend other dudes do that. Because some of y'all just too caught up with your toxic masculinity. I said it before and I'll say it again. You gotta pull your little feminine side out. Thank God my mom raised me, so I'm a little gay. Simple as that. Simple as that. Now, if I just so happen, let's say I'm looking for this nigga dick, and I just so happen to get a sexual assault case put on me, and now I'm in jail, my boys, they got to finish the job for me. I don't care, bro. I don't care if you think it's gay. You got to do it, bro. You are my boy. It is your legal obligation since the moment you added me to your friends list that you do every, you finish everything I can. When I, especially if I'm, 
I'm not able to to the highest degree, which is jail. I am not able to go look for that nigga dick. I'm gonna look in jail. I'm gonna look for that nigga dick in jail. But after that, I'm stuck. I can't break out of jail. That'll look bad on my record. I, I can't do all that, man. Like, so it is your legal obligation as my nigga to go start searching dicks. You don't gotta do it the same way I do. You don't gotta. I, I, I admit, my message was a little aggressive. You know, I could've asked my girl, hey, whose dick is this? I need to go beat his ass. Like, I could've asked that. But I'm a straight up, I'm all about that action, son. I'm all about the action, bro. I'm not all, I'm not about that talking shit. You know, that's where my toxic masculinity come in. I don't talk, nigga. I scrap. And these hands are powerful, bro. Watch this shit. You see that combo right there, bro? If there was a ghost right here, that nigga got purified. Simple as that. So basically, I'm saying, don't let me down. I'm putting faith on y'all to look for this nigga dick while I'm gone. And then when I get out, leave the rest to me. Leave it all to me. If my boys needed me to do this, I would do it for them. Let's say Dalen hit my line up right now. Who was like, hey, can you? Guess what? Some dude just sent Nasha a dick pic. I'm gonna be like, for real? What color is it? Easy as that, bro. It's that simple. It's that simple. You know, like, I just... I don't understand why some of y'all can't do this. I talked to Dalen about this, and he said he not helping, bro. Like, he, I told him he can use his own method. He don't got to use mine. This nigga is snake. He is snake, bro. I'm surrounded by snake-ass niggas, bro. But that's besides the point. That's not the point of the video. So, basically, what I'm saying is, fellas, keep an eye out for your bitch, because she might be a witch. That wasn't the point of the video. Uh, make sure next time your girl get an unsolicited dick pic, you look and you make sure that you are packing more and if you and that you find this dude and you beat his ass. And let's say on the off chance he is packing more. We all done had it. It's just a little circumcision. That's all, guys. You know, Keanu signing out. Uh, wish you all the best. You know, uh, Merry Christmas.